Now, Weather on the Threes, sponsored by Bufalo Contracting. Well, after a benign winter, it's really going to kick into gear for us starting tonight, shortly after sunset, heading through tonight into tomorrow and early Wednesday morning. And then a big change really the rest of the week here forecast wise. Let's get right to it. Little Rockford siding and windows river cam seeing cloudy skies above and with those clouds calm before the storm. Not going to really see a lot of wind today. Those breezes will start to pick up as we head into late afternoon and evening. But boy, look at the Max Storm Tracker radar. There's a lot of color on here with all the various advisories, watches, warnings. We now have some warnings in place for portions of our viewing area. Rock, Green, Stevenson, Joe Davies, Carroll, Whiteside counties, all those shaded in that pink, purple color there. Heavy snow expected, and this is from 6 o'clock tonight through 6 a.m. on Wednesday. Uh, could see a total between seven inches to a foot of snow come down and winds that will pick up latter part of Tuesday into Tuesday night that could gust up to 40 miles per hour. So that's where the warnings are for now. Rest of us with the watches and advisories. Low end with this storm system for all of us, four inches. I think a good five to seven inch snow is a good bet. And some areas, again, could see upwards of a foot of snow come down. So let's look at the current conditions here again. Quiet morning temperature at 28 degrees. A little bit of wind for us, but not too terribly significant. Steady barometer for now. And again, those numbers will rise today up to mid and low 30s for daytime highs. Now, as far as the forecast by time goes, well, this will take us out to about nine o'clock. Starting to see that snow arrive from the south and west. And then as we spread this out over a couple of hours, Snow spreads out too, and we'll see a consistent snow heading into tonight and very early tomorrow morning. Might be just a little bit of a break, maybe about right now tomorrow, but there's more snow to come. That snow expected to continue through the day tomorrow. I think tomorrow morning we could wake up to easy two to four inches for the morning commute. Snow continues through the day on Tuesday, right on into Tuesday night, tacking on several more inches. And this snow will have a lot of moisture content to it, so it's going to be wet, heavy for the shovels and plows. And as we do take a look at some of the impacts here from the snowfall, obviously the amount of snow we're going to see, those gusty winds into the latter part of Tuesday and Tuesday night. And with that moisture content to the snow, it could almost make an icy concrete on the roadways as it gets packed down. So it could be a lot of issues out there as far as the amount of snow and again, the amount of moisture in it. Temperatures today at about mid 30 range, cloudy. Again, the snow expected to begin maybe early on off to the west about seven, but more so after eight, nine o'clock tonight. Snow during the day tomorrow, right into Tuesday night. And we could see another round of snow Wednesday night into Thursday morning. Another quick one to two inches, 25 on Thursday. More snow potential Friday into Friday night, maybe another couple quick inches there. And then down to one on Saturday night. Sunday, 10, and that's going to be a struggle to make it up to that 10 degree reading. So things have changed in a big way for us after what's been a calm winter so far. We're really going to step into it starting tonight and through the day tomorrow. Andy and Marta. This will be interesting. Yeah, it's going to be a challenge over the next <laughs> week, it looks like at least. Thank you, Aaron. Bundle up. Yeah. yeah.